Terra Talk. My name is Jaden Campbell, and I'm here with Tyron Proctor, and we're going to be answering some of your important questions. So, Tyron, just last week you broke the Centennial Conference 60-meter hurdle record by 0 .01 of a second. How did it feel to hear you broke a record that stood there since 2015? Um, honestly, when it first happened, I didn't know I did it for like three or four minutes after I was done <laughs> because after I finished my race, I had to run back to the starting line again for my next race. Oh, okay. And so I was over there getting ready for that. Uh, I saw my coach standing like near the starting line. I looked at him and I was like, so what was it? <laughs> he put his fingers up. He's like, 3-2. I was like, oh. Or I was like, okay, I knew that was a record because I'd had 3-3 three, three on my mind forever. So this is really exciting. And just to know that like, all the work I've been trying to put in to get my name up there on the record like record books is, is really exciting. It paid off. Yeah, it was really just fulfilling. So looking back, you kind of mentioned this, was this ever something you saw yourself accomplishing? So when I think about like my teammates, my coaches, family, like my brother, especially my brother, because he, uh, he went to UMBC and he set the 60 meter hurdle record there too. Mm -hmm. And he still holds that. So he's someone I would always look, like, look to for answers and like how to, like, hey, how can I do this better? How can I do this better? And just knowing that I had that strong background behind me, it gave me like the confidence that, okay, I can do this. I just gotta just listen, to, listen to the advice I'm getting and just Push follow yourself, through. Yeah. Yeah. Now you're only a junior. What are your plans going forward athletically and academically with a business administration degree? So athletically, I'm just looking to keep on driving some time. Uh, I think right now I'm 23rd, in the, 23rd or 24th in the country. I wanna to be top 20, just get to the nationals, compete for that. Uh, academically just get the business administration degree focus on leadership and management mm -hmm. and then summer 2024 commissioning into the army to serve the country nice what is the difference in your mindset when you get ready for the hurdles compared to the 60 meter dash uh, so with hurdles i feel like i'm the opposite of most people because hurdles is like it's more like easy more natural to me wow. compared to <laughs> having no hurdles there uh i think that's kind of because of my parents it was like if, if your brother's good at it there's no reason you shouldn't be too and so my brother being good, I just wanted to always be like him, do everything he said. And so it was always a hurdle in front of me at that point. Mm. So now not having a hurdle there, it's like I look more, more to my coaches and my teammates for advice and like, hey, how do I, like, what's a better way to get good at this? Because I'm not used to just being an open track. Yeah. So that's the biggest difference. So just, I feel like I look more to my teammates for advice on that. That's good. Thank you. Yeah, no problem. <laughs>